what I did during that summer was I started off because I have a really bad back problem. I have um, degenerative disc disorder, so I've had I had surgery in 2012 to shave off the part of the disc that was putting pressure on my spinal cord, and they did that. But I've been in pain every day for three years now, so they're gonna have to do another surgery, and that's inevitable. There's nothing I can do about that. No, my dad by losing more weight that it'll help me recover faster and just every pound of fat is four pounds of pressure on your bones and stuff so so that's what I'm doing because I'm either going to have a surgery this summer or ne next year next summer the following summer 2016 anyway um what I did in 2013 was I had went full vegan because I had for a few months sort of like January to about June is when I started all this um, I had been watching all the vegan, raw vegan videos, the juicing, all that. I saw fat, fat sick and nearly dead, which was really inspiring. I love that video. And then I started following people on YouTube, um, all the major vegan, raw vegan people. And, um, I still follow them. And so I decided to do that sort of a diet. And so that's what I started probably actually in about... March, April, like April, May, that's when I started eating pretty much raw vegan, vegan. I did that and I had been doing that for a few months without really doing the exercise part of it. And then I went to see my doctor and that's when he told me, hey kid, you gotta lose weight. I don't want to be rude, but that's what you gotta do. And so that next day or so I went to Target and got um, beginning yoga, it's AM, PM sessions. And I started that. And then I and Sarah needed to lose weight, so we started walking around our park together, our local park. And it was about two mile walk one time around. So we were doing, um, I found out about a recreational, aquatic recreational center that was about 10 miles from where I lived. So I drove, got up in the morning, drove there. I started off being in one of those like classes, um, like aquatic women's aquatic classes for like older people <laughs> just to move the body which was fun I did that for a couple weeks but then I found out that um, I was either loosened up enough or something that I could actually swim just swim and uh, I found out how many laps it was about to do one mile and I just started doing one mile and then I was still doing my yoga still walking with my friend and then I started doing two miles and then I was walking not only with my friend, but then we have a treadmill at home. I was walking on the treadmill for like an hour, so and three miles an hour. So I was walking about five miles a day, so I mean two miles a day. And then I cut out the yoga because I either I was overstretching or something. I just or doing too much. And the swimming really made up for it because when I started swimming, of course, you're working your whole body and the weight went off. So I went from... 250 to um, when I came back to school because I was finishing at my bachelor's degree I weighed like 2 216 217 and that's what I weighed when I had started school three years prior so I would gained all that weight in college and my because I did two years at my local community college and I transferred to university and so when I did that, then I was lazy and ate a lot and <laughs> did what normal college kids do, and I gained a lot of weight. So, um, yeah, so I started school again, and then it was hard. Um, I stayed up with the swimming, I stayed up with everything, the food, everything. Because um, by that point, you once you do something for a month or longer, it becomes more of like a, a routine or a habit. So I'd formed the habit of eating that way and exercising and all that. And I didn't have a boyfriend at the time. I had my few friends that I had up here at college, but I was really focused and determined to do what I had to do. So I stayed good until I want to say like October. And then I had a procedure done, a cyst removed from underneath my breast. And that kind of threw things off because I couldn't swim and for like a couple weeks and then basically I got out of the exercise 
because um, I couldn't do anything. So it open thing and underneath, and I have pretty large breasts. It's not a fun thing. Um, so that kind of threw me off, and then what's that? And then it was October, and so then you got November and December and all the food, and <laughs> so I think I gained about five pounds. Because I, I actually, I once I started, like I kept everything up, from I got back to school in September because I go to a quarter school. Um, September, October, like those two months, like I even lost more weight. So I got down to like 210. And so then I gained, like I got to 250. I went back up to like 215. And then I kept with that. 